Hi, I'm Knorr, and welcome to the weekly democracy wrap-up for week 10. <laughs> We've been going at this for a while now, and this is the second time I record this, because I shifted my feature to game around. Turns out uh, that the uh, game I had planned for fe to feature was, well, it was against Chaos, and we've had a Chaos game lately. So, instead you get this featured game, which is... Well, it's about- it's actually just as good. It's against Lizardmen, and uh, Lizardmen are a bit difficult uh, for Chaos to deal with, especially our Chaos, because we don't have that much tackle, and um, we don't have that much uh, claw, making uh, Armor Value 9 and Strength were really annoying. Um, but hopefully we can dish out as much as we take. So if you haven't seen that game already, you probably want to click on this big button right here. Or if you've seen it, you probably want to stick around because I'm going to go over the roster changes and the level ups. Uh, after the first game, unfortunately, Helen Hunting Accident had a horrible accident. And I think she suffered... Um, mine, I can't remember, but it was uh, bad enough that the stream chat voted to have her replaced. So rather than... Um, Helen Hunting Accident as the fourth Chaos Warrior, we now have Lynch Mob Shelton, which I'm sure she'll do a great job at being a Chaos Warrior, and hopefully she won't get hurt as easily as Helen Hunting Accident, but who knows, uh, maybe she will. I think one of the problems, if I remember correctly, is that Helen Hunting Accident was the only Chaos Warrior with guard, so we are a bit low on the guard right now, uh, but that's a problem for another level up, and we can't really do much about it right now. Uh, other than Helen Hunting Accident suffering a horrible accident, Stanley, hit by a Kubrick, managed to level up and get his second skill. He started out with dodge, and, uh, well, he <laughs> rolled a double again. So, for some reason, StreamChat decided to give him Catch. Uh, I'm not w sure what to think of Catch. It's an okay skill. We do have an excellent passer on the team in Jackie Chancel Massacre. But only having one catcher means that my opponent will always know who I'm going to pass to, making it a bit risky. But you know, it might be good in a pinch. We'll see. Or stream chats just bloated the team. Who knows? Either options are equally likely at this point. I've been Knorr, and this has been the weekly democracy wrap up. Don't forget to vote for whatever race I should play in the next marathon stream, which will be on December 1st. And until then, I'll see you on Sunday, because that's democracy time. Oh, uh, one last thing. Uh, if you want to, if you feel like you haven't played enough with your Mr. Hadwick Invitational teams, and I mean, who have, except for me. Uh, you should probably stick around on Fridays and Sundays because those are our Mr. Hadwick, Mr. Hadwick Invitational Spin Nights. Uh, trying to make sure that we have a good amount of people that can spin in matchmaking so we all get some fun games. So if you want to play some more and who doesn't, uh, just stick around after well, my streams or during my streams and spin. Spin, 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 spin into eternity. And before eternity happens, I'll see you on Sunday. Bye.